The Pepperdine men's basketball team in Moraga on Thursday night to take on the St. Mary's Gales, a battle between two of the top four teams in the West Coast Conference. The Waves' only lead came at 3-2 off this nice pass from Malcolm Brooks to Brendan Lane, but the Waves will be battling from behind the rest of the night. Brendan Lane bounced back nicely from a couple of tough games last weekend. Here he is with the tip in, Brendan 11 first half points. Here's Jeremy Major now driving in for two of his 10 points. Here's Malcolm Brooks on the right. Referee's going to put his hands up for three that will be later changed to a two. Malcolm Brooks finds a Teef Russell on the left side. He'll stick the jumper. From up top, Stacey Davis will go hard to the basket and finish. Waves trailed by as many as 11 in the first half, but they battled back. Here's Lamont Murray Jr. on the putback late in the half. Waves would only trail 40-35 at the break. On to the second half, Malcolm Brooks with a pull-up jumper, two of his 11 points. And Brendan Lane working down low, little hook shot. Lane would finish with a team-high 18 points. This basket would start an 11-2 run, pulling the Waves within one point. Here's Amadi Udini with the drive, makes the basket. He's fouled, Waves within three points, under five minutes to play. Waves couldn't keep the St. Mary's off the free throw line, however. Gales never relinquished the lead in the second half. Austin Mills driving in two of his career high tying 10 points. However, St. Mary's wins this one 80 to 74. Pepperdine dropping to 12 and 9 overall, 5 and 4 in the WCC. They'll look to bounce back on Saturday at Pacific.